welcome back so in this video this is actually part two of one of my previous video where i described how efficiently you can search for a postdoc and phd position in ireland so i told a strategy and i told that uh, you can directly go to the university job vacancy website which i also gave a link in the description of that video so you can directly go to the university websites uh, job vacancy website and you can see um, that which uh, phd or postdoc positions uh, are available in that particular university uh, because as i told before that in ireland there are very uh, few universities or uh, sort of um, research institute so you can track them separately uh, each like week you can each week or every two week you can uh, you can scan all the university uh, job vacancy websites. So, and in that document, I created list of all universities uh, you can uh, sort of uh, search for. Now, in this video, I can uh, I'm going to give you two more uh, sort of uh, very very important uh, sort of uh, organization, uh, and they are sort of very very uh, important. Uh, in terms of uh, research uh, in Ireland. So the number one is Euraxis Ireland and number two is Irish Universities Association. So Euraxis Ireland is actually uh, mm, a very sort of uh, uh, important sort of institute uh, organization. They play a very important role for uh, uh, providing all sorts of supports for uh, European or uh, non-European sort of uh, researchers to settle in Ireland. So uh, you can directly book one-to-one -one sessions with uh, the officers in the Euraxis Ireland. I'll give a link in the description below. And I th and Euraxis Ireland, uh, not only sort of uh, Euraxis, this, uh, this organization Euraxis, it's place it has uh, like uh, offices um, across the globe okay so for example uh, you, if you are looking for postdoc or phd position in france you can search uh, euraxis france they will be helping you how to sort of uh, relocate in uh, in france as a researchers so every country probably they have a uh, sort of an office so that also you can i will give you uh, a link in the description below because you may not be interested in uh, getting a postdoc or phd in ireland but any other european country or any other country where your access uh, sort of offices are there i think they have the most of the country uh, just today i attended one of their uh, sort of uh, uh, webinar where they sort of uh, uh, discussed how they help uh, to the researchers to come in Europe, especially Ireland, uh, uh, and they provide all sort of information. So uh, so I'll give you a link in the description below because, uh, you, uh, because actually, so the thing is, this is how things uh, are working. So you apply to some job, let's say it's a PhD or postdoc, you uh, you uh, get an interview call you uh, appear in the interview uh, if you are not in ireland uh, hopefully the interview will be online so and then you sort of uh, they choose the university uh, choose you as a postdoc or phd student i mean the position you applied for now the next thing it happens is uh, in most of the cases in postdoc okay not the phd in some PhD, some cases it is the PhD also. I'll tell you uh, that in a minute later. So let's say you are applying for postdoc. Uh, then, then next thing after the university selects you that you uh, will be asked to contact uh, your access or your access will directly contact uh, contact you because the university contact the your access and probably your access contact you. But anyway, at, 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 at the next stage, you will be in touch with your access people because they will provide you something called hosting agreement, right? So this hosting agreement is uh, a, the work permit document in Ireland. And your access play a very, very uh, important role that you get this hosting agreement uh, within like three or four weeks or maximum five, six weeks. 
so uh, so in general getting a work permit for the companies or any other sector it bit a, a, a bit of a work and process but for the researcher it's very very sort of easy due to the uh, role of uh, uh, euraccess uh, the officers and so on so uh, for me i also was sort of contacted with uh, via the uh, people from the euraccess and they were excellent in clearing every doubt related to what my rights are what my family a sort of uh, get sort of benefits uh, if i uh, do a postdoc or in general researcher career and uh, another thing is uh, as i told before that if you get a two years uh, postdoc or two years research uh, contact contract uh, with iris Uh, in Ireland, then you are automatically at the end of second year. You will be given a, a STEM four visa, which is a permanent residency in Ireland. So what it means is that after con- completing the two years uh, contract with the um, with the particular university, you don't you can switch your uh, job uh, in any other places, any other sector you like, and for that you don't need any work permit or permission from the Department of Trade and Enterprise or the or permit uh, sec- section of the irish government so this is not the case with any other uh, sector uh, in ireland for others other sector they at least need needs a 3 years contract uh, because uh, uh, because of this uh, getting the stamp for thing uh, so uh, so yeah so i'll give uh, an, an another organization i wanted to share is that irish universities association so uh they also uh, have a section jobs and vacancies uh you can also check uh their websites for finding phd and postdocs but as i told in my previous uh video about searching jobs and postdocs in Ar- in ireland especially from the university uh then it is best to go to the each university job vacancy websites and you will see their vacancies a uh, sort of uh, an application portal so even if you find the jobs uh, vacancy uh, post job vacancy in university in the euraccess website or in the iris universities association websites you eventually have to apply through the university or the organization portal which is separate from the euraccess or the iris website so i'll give you uh, a link in this uh, description of this video so you if you have any sort of doubt related to relocating ireland as a researcher you can directly send an email or book an one to one sessions with you access ireland they are super helpful uh, so and also i'll give you the iris universities association uh, website uh, and also where you can find the job vacancies in their website so Mm, yeah and if you have any sort of uh, formal or informal questions you can ask me uh, about that uh, so if i know i'll get back to you and uh, yeah that's all i wanted to uh, uh, inform in this video so yeah thank you so much